Your job, eat his ass the whole match. So you just gotta play like you're on your own. Because you are. Why do you throw a bomb? Do you need to throw a bomb here? Do you really need to make a move? Alright. First things first, what do you have to matrix and what is your job? So... Oh sh- yeah. I, This is like a higher ranked game. You got Broski. So, dude, versus Broski, this guy only plays Pharah. Your job, eat his ass the whole match. Uh, so you already have no Matrix, and you haven't really done anything besides just eat a couple of rockets. Yeah, your job is just to get on the Pharah, and if they don't have a Mercy, then Pharah is free. But, you, just like, if you pepper down Mercy, she can't heal, right? So if you're always peppering her, she just can't heal. So I would look for that as much as you can. Um, and then maybe, you know, combine with your soldier and your, your Anna, maybe you can take her out. The soldier is zoning me. Yeah, so it'd definitely be a good, good idea to play, um, Sigma. But like, in these long sidelines like this, you're, okay, since you're just capping, you, you know, you peek out, get healed. Touch the cart, and then when you realize that the enemy team is shooting at you, then you then you hide again. Whoa, where are you going? All right, he's in. You just don't have like anybody with you, so you don't peek unless you're full healed and you have armor. This is good. You're playing fine, bro. Jack. Mm. No waste rockets like that. You never know, dude. What if someone... What if, like, they're, uh... You needed to kill their Zen because he was kind of low and you needed your rockets. I mean, let's just watch. How much old charge did you get off these rockets? One. One. One percent. Brain it on me, I guess. Dude, you want that boob, don't you? Don't be afraid of him, man. I mean, you're playing fine. Oh, shit. Think about when, like, why, why do you throw a bomb? Do you need to throw a bomb here? Do you really need to make a move? Probably not. I think you just lose your mech anyway. So just, like, think about why you're throwing your bomb. Am I throwing the bomb to stop the enemies from pushing? Um, do I need to make a clutch play? Just think about why you're using abilities, and you will probably just play so much better. So, you pretty much lost that because you went for that bomb. That's good. I mean, you're doing fine, you're just like... Oh, what are you doing? If you, as long as you're just like, you know, death blowing, playing with your team, this is good, you're gonna have to take this 1v1. When you, when you fight Sigmas, you don't want to get hit. So, you can actually absorb in between his shots if you juggle his your matrix. So, like, you hold your matrix, for his first shot, and then you drop it, and then when he goes for another shot, you can Matrix again, and you drop it. You can do that. Same with Tracer. That you might get hit once or twice because the timing's not perfect, but with Tracer, it's perfect. You're taking this one v one, and you're really, really low health. Yeah, you're playing fine. You, 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 your team is kind of deadlifting, though. Like, not that you're playing bad, but uh, yeah, they're doing. Your team's doing a lot. They said you're struggling against the Reaper, so that just comes down to you know you holding Matrix on Reaper when he teleports in. That was a good counter dive. Uh, when you're, I don't know. It seems like you're kind of freaking out a lot, like. When you're doing it, doing moves. So, just like, if you need to just slow it down. <laughs> yeah, you kind of lost them. Yeah, you never want to not have Matrix with, you know, or not have a jump. Okay, think about like Zarya's, right? Where is Zarya's kill zone? It's right in front of her. It's the same as Reaper. So, you don't want to land, like, in this circle, around Reaper, without your jump. Because, 
I mean, realistically, you never want to be in his face like that unless you're just matrixing him while your enemy team is killing him. Or while your team is killing him. I recently upped my sense. 5.15. Pretty much lost that because, uh... Yeah, you're just like... This is the main guy. This is the guy you want to shut down. He's the carry. And it's not like Broski's an insane reaper, right? He's a ferret player. He's just doing what he has to do. Matrix usage. Oh shit. See, that's what happens, dude. You never you never want to take a 1v1 with Reaper. You just don't win it. Even if even if you're a better player, you just don't win it because of how much he heals. I would prioritize peeling. I would be peeling like all, most of the time in this. But I I recently developed a playstyle where I just peel for my Ana the whole time. But since you have like five players that could dive, I would just tell probably just tell your guy to go Moira and like do a six man dive type shit. And then oh my god. Dude you need to up your sense for sure. That shit is too low. What's the best way to deal with Reaper? Well, you could either ignore him or you could have someone shut him down. Like, it's not like a Reaper is just inherently like a boss character, right? So you can't like one v one him unless you're, you know, a, a DPS. Yeah, usually in most comps you sit with your core, then you know just try to hold Matrix on Reaper, rockets him. And try to do as much damage as possible and try to force like 2v1s against them. Since you have the sim, you, you can just chill. You don't have to look for any crazy dives. This is good that you're scouting, seeing where they're at. What sensors do you recommend? You could try my sense. This is risky. Hold on, hold on. It's risky committing to someone with your jump because they can just jump away, right? And he did. Like, he, he was trying to bait out cooldowns by existing in this space, right here. So now you're just left out of the fight for like, you know, a few seconds. Uh, that sucks. You're kind of like not, uh... Okay, try this. When you have bomb, just pretend that you don't have bomb and play normal. Play like you normally would. And then you won't go for those crazy bombs. And then you'll just have bomb for remake. That could have been, you could have had a bomb right there, you know? Alright. Just like... I gotta hop in a queue, but just play with your core a bit more, and when in these like these weird call, if you don't know what to do, just play with your play around your Anna and just like bodyguard him. Don't read this out loud, but Guru, you're my favorite streamer. You're so good in handsome. Thanks, dude.